Dennis Lilly. Dennis yeah. said he was here 95 times. I've still got a fair way to go, but I reckon it's in the... What's it with fast quarters and numbers? <laughs> uh, we, we must be good with numbers. I don't know. We're obviously more intelligent than the batsmen. I think most people know that, so maybe that's it, Tash. Some people say that they're only fast bowlers. But there's lots more to India and Australia than just, than just stories of cricket in the And you've been almost on the cusp of it all as, as you're here today. So more, more than just cricket, going, going to Australia, but what, what, what would you tell people about watching cricket in Australia? Oh, definitely. You know, the common passion, obviously, is, is cricket. Without a doubt, the passion and love for the game over here in India never ceases to amaze me. But over in Australia, we love our sport. We love our cricket as well. But... You know, Australia is such a multicultural country and, and the amount of time I spent over here and the different cultures just within India has it, been incredible um, and I love my time here but, but back home you know, to watch a, a test match, my favourite ground in the world still the Sydney Cricket. It's an incredible experience but not only that, come out for a little bit. <coughs> Sorry. What the An Indian sledging and Aussie but that's alright. <laughs> looking for Sachin, is he around here somewhere? But anyway. No, he's with Mr. Trump. But yeah, so to watch cricket in Australia is an amazing pronunciation. <laughs> it's an amazing experience, but also to get out and see what Australia has to offer. We saw on the, the two films, short films there, it made me want to go back to Australia and experience it again. I, I grew up in the bush, but you know, there's so much to, to get out there. And life is about experiences and you know, from the Sydney Harbour to Uluru to the Outback to the Great Barrier Reef to Melbourne to, to the wildlife. It's an incredible place. So, and I think that's the main thing is about, you know, cricket, about uh, multiculturalism, about just that friendship, that hospitality, generosity. You know, we're not too different. You know, I think that love for cricket is the one thing that really unites us. I in the world. Thrilled to see uh, yeah, that um, the now largest cricket ground in the world uh, here in uh, here in India it was also indeed uh, designed by uh, an Australian architectural firm. So uh, making sure that even as somebody out uh, outgrows the MCG, we still keep an Australian edge in it. But <laughs> as well, uh, let me tell you, when Astra India come and play in Australia, it's like India are playing <laughs> home ground advantage. Yeah. The noise. If you've got the same amount of Indians in the crowd as you have Australians, you would have thought there was ten times more Indians. <laughs> just the noise and the energy and the passion is incredible. And you know, just the support they receive is amazing. So I'm looking forward to seeing how the Women's World Cup finishes up, the, the, you know, the men's later on in the year, and then the Test Series in Australia. It's going to be a big one. So you know, I think there's no perfect time to see you know, Indians continue that friendship and that mateship that we've created over a long time. And, continue to grow. We've got a natural.